again. You alright, man? Yeah, I'm good. I'm just tired. I haven't got a lot of sleep lately. Mmm. Is it because of... <coughs> you can say her name, guys. Is it because of Alec? Yeah, it's probably... Because you've been acting so strange ever since that party. Dude, I would too. Especially considering... I'm right it's, here. It's, it's a tough situation, you know? Not knowing whether or not to be in a relationship. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it is. But, um, Gavin, you know what you really need to do now? This ought to be good. Suck it up, champ! Like, seriously, stop it. I hate your puns. But puns are the best. In my book. Your puns are horrible. Maybe we should stop. Yeah, we, sh we should stop, yeah. Gavin doesn't seem to be a big fan of this. I'd rather catch a deadly disease than deal with you guys right now. Well, uh, I got some... Messed up jeans for you. you probably get some, you get some nose in there. Alright, alright. You know. I know we're throwing a lot at you, but just try and catch up. This one must be what hell's like. No, uh, hell's under there. Underwear. Exactly. Alright, alright. That one was a bit of a stretch. Yo, Gavin, are you alright, man? Yeah, I'm good. I'm just tired. You know, I haven't got that much sleep lately. Mmm. Is it because of... <coughs> you can say her name, guys. Is it because of Alec? Yeah, it's probably... Because you've been acting so strange ever since that party. Dude, I would too, especially considering... I'm right here. It's, it's a tough situation, you know? Not knowing whether or not to be in a relationship. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it is. But, um... Gavin, you know what you really need to do now? Gavin, what are you doing? Gavin. Gavin. Gavin! Yo, did you notice Gavin hasn't been out of this room all day? Alright, I'm just gonna say this right now. I'm really busy, so if you could just not talk, thanks. Let's wrestle in his jimmies. Dude, he's working on his midterm presentation. I have a midterm presentation. Oh, fun. I didn't know that. Sorry. No. Not fun. Yeah, I know. Is sarcasm like a foreign language to you or something? I was just saying so. Jeez. Look, if you're gonna be like that, I, I just wanted to borrow your computer. Mine's broken and I got some stuff to do, so. Alright, you know what? I gotta go to the library anyway. Gotta check out a book and find some quotes, so. You can borrow it until I get back. Sweet. Seems Thanks, man. Such a good guy. Yeah, you are, actually. I'd marry someone like you. Who are you and why are you here? You brought me here, man. No, I didn't. Alrighty, I guess I wouldn't expect you to understand. <sighs> I am the vessel of your subconscious. You are supposed to have an epiphany, and I am going to help you get there. You know, the whole make you a better Gavin for tomorrow thing. <laughs> so I'm dreaming. Golly, you're so smart. Yeah, thanks, you know. I try, that's why I went to school, but there's a point where I question it, though. Dang it. Staying in school. More important business. Hell yeah. So basically, you're my subconscious? Exactly. I'm your ghost of Slept Past. Slept Past? Yeah. Uh, present and future will be here soon. Alright, I get the reference, Charles Dickens. But what's the whole slut part about? I mean, I'm sorry to break it to you, but... 
kind of a slut. Please. I'm not a slut. You're on a path to self-destruction, so I need you to buckle up right now so we can take the journey to self-discovery. Yeah, this isn't a dream. Because if this was a dream, I'd wish for you to be gone. First off, if this wasn't a dream, would I be able to do this? That makes sense. Exactly. Second off, you can't just wish away your subconscious like that. I mean, you can alter the vessel. Honestly, I'm a little surprised I'm here. I mean, should be a bikini model or something. So if I wanted to change it, I could do that right now? Yeah, it's your epiphany. Do whatever you want. What? Put my clothes back on! Nope. This isn't even funny. <laughs> kind of is. <sighs> if I didn't already know who the gay guy was, I would pick you to be him. Listen up, Bakura. I'm sick of you. I'm done. Alright, so I'm gonna give you my spiel, and I'm gonna leave. <laughs> that sounds beyond perfect. Alright, so, basically, I'm here to make sure you understand that relationships aren't the end of the world. They are, but if you wanted me to have one, what would you want me to do? Well, women are complicated. Extremely complicated. Like, so complicated that people have spent years trying to understand them, and that's why we know so much about science, because they quit and went off to something they actually could understand. Universities offer a degree program now on how to make a woman happy, but the attrition rate is so high for the eight-year PhD course that most people don't even make it. Like, look, here's a manual for the 101 level. This is huge, dude. Exactly. Is there one for guys? Yeah. Significantly shorter, though. <laughs> so true. Way easier. Yeah. So, point is, there's not really a good answer for that. I mean, we can watch a bunch of rom-coms and try to determine what not to do, but what to do? That's a little bit more difficult. Alright, well. The president will be here soon. I mean, he doesn't have a great concept of time, but he should be on his way. Alright, well, I'm gonna leave, so I'll see you later. Drake! What? What are you doing on my computer? Nothing, man. What do you mean? There are so many viruses on here right now. What, what were you doing? Dude, check his browsing history. D Good idea. What's wrong with you? Dude, what did he look at? Porn! What? Not even the good guy! No way! Dude, the shit the viruses quarantine the uh -huh. computer. Oh. 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 God, is that the video? It's so weird, right? Is, is that a pterodactyl? Dude, it's so disgusting! Oh my god, there's no way that it's anatomically correct. Oh, dude, 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 dude. What is he doing right now? What is he doing? Oh my god, that's a she. Oh, that's kind of impressive. Dude, don't, don't say <laughs> Yeah, Jake! What's wrong with you? Look, I, I didn't always do anything bad. I mean, yeah, I did that, but I also did some good stuff. Yeah. All right. Tell me more about these good things you've done. Well, first off, I downloaded some new memory for you because I, I noticed you're running slow. And also, a Nigerian prince, he needed some help. I helped him out, so that, that's got to be some good karma. And then also, I came across his website. It was the 100th visitor. I gave him all your information, and you got a free iPad, man. You got a free iPad coming. So, I mean, what else do you want from me? You downloaded memory? You downloaded memory? Yeah, didn't it help? Dude, those were all scams, man! No. No, people aren't that bad. Come on. There's only good in people. Good in people? Dude, you should use that line when you run for Miss America. The internet is full of scams. Scams are everywhere, man! Can't be. My computer is so slow right now. There's titties flashing everywhere. I don't even know what to do. Maybe that's just a feature, you know? Dude. I don't even have my presentation anymore. Just BS it. It's dude, easy. Dude, I'm not you. I'm not good at BSing things. Okay, all you gotta follow, you listen, the VETH principle. V-T-H. What? Yeah. You gotta be vague, you gotta go to a lot of tangents, and you gotta throw in random lines like, oh, I think this speaks volumes about the human condition. That's it. That's it. I am so done right now. Where does the H even come from? I, you know that phrase, intelligence is key? Yeah. We're locked out right now. Hey Bex. Hey Gavin, what's up? 
Uh, nothing. Um, you know stuff about women, right? Um, hopefully, because I am one. Um, well, basically, I don't know if I really want to, like, uh, date Alec, but if I were going to, how would I impress her? Well, I think that's not the question you should be asking. The question you should be answering is if you want to date her. Well, I don't even know. How about you sleep on it? That always helps me figure out the best thing to do. Thanks, you're the best. No problem. What if that Nigerian prince really needed help? Oh yeah, and there's a pill for instant abs, and oh, I can grow my penis one to four inches overnight! I just took a nap, and I'm still tired of this shit. Wait, can you actually do that? <sighs> hey, I uh, fixed your computer. What? You did? Yeah, uh, see, I just deleted the, uh, the virus. Oh my, David, you are so smart! Thank you so much! You're positively <sighs> welcome. Now, uh, do you think that you're getting up soon, so can you grab me a pallet? <laughs> David, anything for you, David. I'm glad that's over. Yeah, me too. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We got this. Uh, second thought, I think I'll grab the power right. <clears throat> Expecting someone else. Someone else? Yeah, I you were just here. No, I wasn't. I just saw you. Look, man, we got stuff to do. I am the ghost of Slut Future. Present was going to come, but he's too busy enjoying himself at the moment. Sounds about right. So here's the thing I am the scary one. <laughs> Robber. I'm gonna show you what your current decisions are going to end up leading to. You don't look that scary, bro. I'm not supposed to look scary. I'm gonna scare you with the future. But yeah, you're at a fork in the road right now, and you have two very distinct paths. One of them will make you very happy. On the other hand, if you continue to sleep around and be a man whore, you're going to end up getting a disease. A disease? Which one? Chlamydia? Syphilis? Herpes? The clap? Scabies? Ringworm? Lice? Alcoholism? Christianity? Homosexuality? Tendinitis? Arthritis? Tourette's? <sighs> AIDS? Well, I mean, if it's just HIV and not full-blown AIDS, that's chill. I, I could deal with that. I could deal. No. It's going to be way worse than all of those. You're going to have a child. Not a kid. Let me show you. So there it is. This is the moment you make your biggest mistake. Well, that's you, right there. Going at it. Uh, Very uh, hot rod, by the way. Like, good job. Thank you. And here we go. Right here. See that? You finished. Of course you did. Yeah. Well, no worries though. She finished first. Um, but on the other hand, the condom broke. And that's it, man. That's your biggest mistake. Now, now that I've seen it, I can change it. No, it doesn't work that way. The universe has already decided your path. It's going to force itself to make sure that happens. You know, kind of like Final Destination. Look, Gavin, you, you can follow your heart, and you can be happy. Or you can follow, well, your private region and have a little baby Gavin running around. It's just... The idea of a serious relationship scares me so much. Yeah, it, you're going to be vulnerable, and... Yeah, you can get hurt, but... So what? Your future's going to be absolutely miserable if you never let anyone in. But it might be too much. Don't do it just for you. If you really like her, do it for her. Alright. Well, I gotta go, because I have to do another epiphany. With who? One of your roommates. He's having trouble discovering himself. Will I ever see you again? Hopefully not. Remember, Gavin. Be the man Mr. Rogers wants you to be. Uh, hey, hey, Alec. I have a question for you.